Hey, what's up guys? Back again with another Queen Pop Laloon. This is going to be my first video drop since the update I had. Four wars in a row wasted by these stupid constant updates and then update and then let's nerf Valks. Let's make Valks awesome. Let's update you again with an additional, uh, you can update if you want update, whatever. Finally, um, I'm recording this. I just hit this base and I want to get this recording because for some reason, if I wait a day, they're all gone. But this is a maxed out base and I want to show you what changes affects the update. I had great videos on the last war to show you um, about how to pull the CC. Now I've seen CC changes since the update. Before, you know, you had three minutes, 30 seconds. Uh, double poison could kill everything but hounds. So tons of people were throwing hounds into their CCs. And that's what I created this attack for. But now you're back to three minutes and troops leave the poison. So people are throwing different things. Uh, you got the CC right here. This is the Sudoku or the PCB base. All the same. Um, and it's pretty much inside the outer ring area and that's what you want your cc to be in so you have to break it now you got your blowers are pointed here and here uh and the cc is sitting kind of further out here so i want to come into the cc on the closest spot i can that the, where the blowers are set up and the cc is set up it messes where i would actually want to do my queen pop you know in a perfect world if i had my choice um Maybe I'd come in from this direction or you want to trap your expos too. So I'd probably save these three air defenses and the queen's kind of sitting here. So that's where I'd want to trap her, you know, have these hounds pop over her. But I can't do that because the CC, the closest I can get to it is over here. So I need to destroy that air defense and come in. Um, it is what it is. I'm limited with blast. You know, he's number 21 all he can do is this attack. That's what I created him for. So I'm going to have to zap out this air defense and just eat these. I got two maxed out whiz towers, a maxed out expo pointed up. I'm just going to have to eat it. The other thing I don't know is where are his Teslas? There's a giant area over here. I think there's probably Teslas there. Could be a double bomb if he's not too smart. So where are his other Teslas? They could be anywhere in these zones. They could even be in these outer zones. There could be nothing there. So if his Tesla is here, that's going to mess me up. I'm going to zap that out and bring in my loons. I'm going to drop two originally to see if I can just sacrifice two to bring it. Um, a Tesla actually does pop up there, so I have to throw three in real quick to get out his full CC because it's full of archers and wizards. And that's what people are doing now since the update, putting a bunch of uh, low level, you know, low counting troops in. So it's harder to pull. Once I get that pull, you'll see I dropped a loon out and brought some extra archers and goblins. The next thing you're going to notice with this update is people are going back to the old school. Let's throw random crap in the corner. So it's harder to get under three minutes. And it wasn't that long ago, guys, our attacks were three minutes or less. Um, I was a little worried with this attack because I only used pups to clean up. But now I brought along some extra uh, gobs, archers. You'll see I end up wasting them all on the CC. But I do that so I have extra troops to clean up. I have extra archers to set on those, clean those up so my loons and pups don't have to fly around. So that's one change to this attack. Um... So that's it. I'm going to blast that out and I'm going to create my triangle there. I want to go with the blowers. So I'm just going to do a wide loon set and then a quick hound drop. Nope. Minus that. I'm doing a wide hound set and a quick loon drop. Let's just watch it guys. I'm rambling. So you'll see I come in and I just quake and zap real quick you'll notice the other thing i kind of expedite things i'm not doing fast mo you got to be quick on these attacks um i saw that tesla popped up and right here i'm counting so i zoom in and i sent three loons because that tesla popped up and i was getting pounded by that but i wanted to make sure all right i got archers there and wizards 
Okay, I see that last wizard pull up in the back. I'm good. If I didn't see that guy pull up in the back, I probably would have been screwed, actually. Might have sent in like three more lands. So here we got uh, bring an archer to kind of anchor him. And then I have to sacrifice both my heroes. I kind of only wished I would have to sacrifice one, but with that, you know, I had to sacrifice both of them for it. But you don't need them after this. That's all you need your heroes for. You know, this isn't the old school where you pull out the troops and then you kill them with a loon and use your heroes to kill the queen. That's it. You use your heroes for the CC. So I bring in my hounds. You'll see I brought my first hounds in really, really far. And then I bring my loons in really, really close. I'm saving my rages. because I'm. That's This is a high DPS base. Really close-knit. I know I'm going to need to punch through it real fast. And that's another reason I waited on my second hounds and I brought them in last. Because once my first hounds take the beating, I know they're going to pop. My loons are going to take a little side beating while my second hounds get in. I want those hounds to be untouched to make it through the base. There's a little tip. So they do make it through. And you'll see just as the hounds are blowing up, my second ones kind of get there. My loons take out everything. That queen goes down. I saved hound, or loons to bring in on the backside and my haste. Because with this base, the air defenses sit close to that outside corner. So there you go. Oh, my last hound just finally popped. I have that whole group of loons. Um, looks like I didn't plan right for that last Tesla archer tower. But I don't really know where they are. I did set up two archers on the outside, take care of those outside buildings, and I set a goblin, because goblins eat up all those outside trash. I've even brought four goblins on some earlier attacks. I wish I had my earlier attacks to show you guys, but that's it. I think this whole attack was done in under two minutes, so pff, taking 30 seconds off my clock, not a biggie. Look at all those loons left. Look at all those pups alive. Archers, goblin, everything. Game over. That fast. Lickety split, guys. I, I don't know what to tell you. New update. They nerfed a lot. They nerfed witches. They gave you better Valks. Then they nerfed the Valks. They've nerfed air for months. But this attack keeps, keeps going. Keeps popping, if you will. So, hope you guys like it. Press like and subscribe. Yes, there are going to be changes in this attack, guys. It's okay to drop a loon or two. Bring some cleanup troops. You're still going to have to sacrifice your heroes for the CC uh, if it's not a hound. And we've done, we're three wars in now on the new update. And I haven't seen a hound in any of them. We used to see hounds in every single war and every single CC. Maybe it's the people we're playing. I don't know. We'll check it out next war. We'll give you more updates as this continues, as uh, this new update keeps taking effect. You know things are going to change. But hopefully this makes sense, and uh, hope you guys like it. I'll see you next time.